Hi, it's Corrine for Wild Orchid Crafts, and today I'd like to share a design team box with you along with a haul. I thought I would share this because I've received several comments asking me to do so, and I know that it has helped me in the past to see things um, instead of just pictures online, so I thought I'd share with you. I have two pretty large boxes, so um, I will also list everything down in the description box for links for any of this, so in case you're interested in ordering them yourself, you can find it. So I have not actually, I've opened the boxes, but I have not actually gone through them, so I'm going to go with through them with you. Now these, um, with the design team boxes, we're able to order what we choose. So this is all stuff that I've ordered, um, but some of it I've never actually seen, so I'm really excited to actually get my hands on them. Here are the 100 Mixed Color Summer Blooms. These are MKX160, and as you can see, you get several colors. I've never had these from Wild Orchid Crafts, so I'm excited to work with these. A lot of this I've never had, actually. Some of it is my favorite things that I've ordered, but um, like these Sweetheart Blossoms, I've never used. These are MKX349. Look how cute those are. I love Wild Orchid Crafts leaves, but I've never tried the green and pink rose leaves. These are the 25 millimeter, so they're they're little. They're perfect size though. They're MKX 248. I use the white 30 millimeter, and I use them almost on every project. So I'm excited to try these. Here are some white bead berry spray clusters, GST 155, and these are really pretty. These are prettier in person. I have several um, colors of these, so I'm going to have to try more of these. Now these I've used in the past. These are flower shaped flat back pearls. These are 12 mil millimeter and they're MKX282. I've used these on several projects. Here is lace, the white net lace MKX592. This looks really pretty. I've not tried this yet. and you get 1.1 yard. This is really pretty. This is white cotton lace, MKX402. I'm gonna zoom in just a little. And this is really pretty. These are all things I've not tried. This is the natural cotton lace, MKX403. I love these, these are the Tulip flowers, the pink tone. These I love to use on projects. These are MKX143. I love how all their stuff comes packaged as well. Here is some of their vintage seam binding, and I've used this in the past. This is just absolutely beautiful seam binding, so I had to order more. It's MKX482. They have several colors of this. There are little dove embellishments. These are GST172. Now here are some of their um, laser embellishments. These are back to vintage, vintage oval cutout set, GST031, and you get several in here. It looks like four or five. These are so fun to work with. These take ink and stains very well. This is the Blueberry Swirls frame cutout, GST093. And look at the detail on that. Hopefully, there you go. And you may have seen me use this. I ordered another one because to me, these are just a must have in your stash. This is the Open Work Mannequin cutout, GST066. And it is so dainty and so pretty. And then this is a new one for me. This is the background wall cutout, GST038. So I look forward to working with those. These two are, there are five of them. They're glass dome cabochon, cabochons, and they're GST162. And they have the Paris, Italy, and it says, um, it has the, I think it says Italy here, and it has the Eiffel Tower in it. Let me take one out of the bag so you can see it up close. Aren't those pretty? 
And then these are the silver corners, the filigree silver corners, MKX 184. These can be painted as well, but I love the silver. I got some of the hip rosebuds, GST 020. And I got them in um, white and also pink, pale pink. Those are so pretty to me. I think I ordered a few of those. More tulips. I ordered the ivory hip rosebuds. I just love these. And then here's some more of the pink ones. These are the Cosmo Daisies, MKX199. And look at the different colors that you get them in. I also ordered them in white, MKX119. I ordered the Ivory Sweetheart Blossoms. These are MKX344. And these are my favorites, but I ordered just a package of the pale pink chrysanthemums, MKX202. The chrysanthemums are probably my favorite um, flower to use, so I ordered a couple of the the pink, pale pink. And then here are some apple blossoms, MKX 469. I ordered 10 of the large wild rosebuds. These are MKX 100. And again, these can be inked or stained. Some more of the uh, hip rosebuds and the large. When I like a flower, I like to order two or three of them, just depending on how many come in a package. So here is just the white chrysanthemums. These are MKX 117. And again, these are some of my absolute favorite. Here are some white stamens, MKX 470. These are a little bit different. Some of the pastel tone Cosmo Daisies. This is set B, MKX 376. Look how pretty those colors are. These are going to be so pretty for spring. And then this is the um, Cosmo Daisy set C, MKX 378. Here are some of the white Tuscany rosebuds, and these are absolutely beautiful. I've not used these either. These are MKX. 620, but look at how beautiful those are. So I got several of those in white. Here are some of the Gypsophilia flowers, MKX 654. These are beautiful. Again, I've not tried these. And then here are um, white ones, MKX 631. This is some pearl, flat back white pearl string, MKX 613. This is beautiful. I have this in um, ivory as well. I ordered a few of the open roses. These are 10 millimeters, so these are tiny, MKX 661, but they're great filler flowers. I love having big ones, but I also like having the small ones in my stash as well. These are the pink tone as well, so these are the same and these are the same. Except these are 15 millimeters, so you can see the difference. Same thing, open rosins, 15 millimeters. This is a mixed color pack, so it's MKX 681. I think flowers are my absolute favorite product to use. Flowers and paper. These are new to me as well, The this color set. This is the um, peach, orange, and white chrysanthemums, QVR061. Aren't these beautiful fall or even summer colors? Oh, dusky pink center wild roses in the 30 millimeter. So these are beautiful size. These are QVR068. 
and then same thing dusky pink center these are 30 millimeter QVR 066 so you can see oh I love these these are just gorgeous I know you probably hear me saying I love these a lot but Wild Orchid Crafts is truly my favorite um, product to use and it has been for many years I got some more of these set C I've been telling you if you follow me at all these are my favorite um, pretty much in every video so I had to get more these are QVR031 I use those all the time I got some of the mixed cottage roses QVR045 and these are the 30 millimeter but look at the different colors you get I love these Some more of the chrysanthemums but in a different color these are QVR080 what a beautiful color combination these are the mixed color open roses 25 millimeter MKX680 here are some of the white cottage roses MKX683 these you have seen these are the 15 millimeter ones these are really pretty these are apple blossoms MKX 625 in white and the sweetheart ones these are pale pink with a pink center I showed you pink pale pink ones earlier but these have a pink center these are MKX 297 these are large mixed pink mulberry wild roses these are 40 millimeters so these are going to be your largest ones these are QVR 025 these are tea roses so you can see that they're um, so different but yet so pretty these are QVR 041 same here And then I ordered three of these because I've never used them, but I figured these are probably going to become a new favorite of mine. So I ordered three of them. And these are the white magnolias, QVR028. And they're absolutely stunning in per person. They have several colors of these. Which here are some of the other colors these are the pastel tone magnolias QVR 029 and look at these and QVR 029 same package and this is lastly the mulberry wild roses QVR 025 which I've already showed you these so I hope it helps to see these um, a little bit better than just a picture if you have any questions please leave me a comment I'll be happy to get back to you and I will also leave links to all of these products in the description box in case you're interested please go by and check out Wild Orchid Crafts thanks so much for watching